Hello and welcome to this short video in the how-to series which will detail the steps required to create and use an undefined collection in Blue Prism. By the end of this video, you will be able to configure an undefined collection and collect data from a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet. So what is a collection stage? As you know, a collection is a group of several data items in one. Once populated, the information in a collection can be accessed using a loop stage. Collection stages are where multiple values are stored in both columns and rows within Blue Prism. There are two types of collections. These are defined and undefined. Defined collections have their column names and data types configured in advance in the collection properties window. However, undefined collections store data from other pages or from business objects. Undefined collections do not have pre-configured column names or data types. This provides Blue Prism with the functionality to read different data types from a variety of sources. The collection columns should all be left blank with no names or data types assigned. Note that you cannot configure selected columns in an undefined collection. Let's take a closer look at how you would create an undefined collection. Create a new process named Undefined Collection Exercise. Add a new data stage to the process. Open the data stage properties and enter data file path for the name and set the data type to text. Set the initial value of the new data item to the location of the file you wish to use. In this video, we will use an Excel file titled Names CSV. Type in the path to the location of the file and click OK. Add a new collection stage named Data Collection and leave the fields and initial value tabs empty. The information for this undefined collection will be populated by the Names CSV file. Click on OK. Add an action stage and update the properties window with the following information. Enter read names data file for the name. Select utility file management as the business object, a VBO which has already been imported. Select get CSV text as collection as the action. Within the inputs tab, type data file path as the value for the CSV file path. This is reference to the data item you created earlier. Type true as the value for the first line as header. Select the outputs tab and drag the collection called data collection to the store in field. Click OK. Now link up the stages. Reset, save and run your process. Open the Data Collection Properties window and select the Current Values tab. Notice how the field names and rows of data have been set at runtime using data from the names.csv file. You have learned how to configure an undefined collection and collect data from a Microsoft Excel spreadsheet. Thank you for watching this video on how to create and use an undefined collection in Blue Prism. If you want to learn more about any of the Blue Prism products, please visit the Blue Prism University via the link in the description below. Or visit the Blue Prism University community to get support from other members and participate in various discussions also via the link in the description below.